Now see one example related to river. A man can swim in still water with a speed of 4 km per hour. How long does he take to cross a river 1 km wide if the river flows steadily at the 3 km per hour and makes his strokes normal to the river current? How far down the river does he go when he reaches the other bank? Now see here this question is very simple. It seems to be too lengthy, but it is not like that. Answer is very simple here. Suppose you have taken these two banks of the river. River is flowing in this direction. Velocity of river to this side, we can take it with respect to ground here. That is equal to how much? 3 km per hour. 3 km per hour. So, here and now this is the point A. He wants to go to the point this other bank B here, but he is making his strokes normal to the flow of the river. It means he is swimming in this direction obviously. So velocity of man, uh, velocity of swimmer with respect to river is to this. He might be reaching somewhere here that is C. This angle is theta. We have to get first time. So simple one we know AB. AB is equal to 1 kilometer and a speed is given to you. So, time is equal to 1 divided by this VSR we know that is 4 kilometer is equal to 4 kilometer per hour. So, we can write 1 by 4 hour. This is the time taken by the swimmer to cross the river. But now you have to find out this distance how much he has traveled along the river. So, this you can be calculated simply BC is equal to I have told this formula that this thing is here VRG multiplied by time. So, that will be here 1 upon 4 into 3 that will be here 0 0.75 kilometer is equal to 750 meter. So, he is traveling this distance that is equal to 750 meters that is 0 0.75 kilometer.